turning your idea into a profitable reality. The power of market research. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel where we dive deep into the world of entrepreneurship, business strategies and how to turn your dreams into profitable realities. Today, we have an amazing topic that I know you'll find extremely valuable. Turning your idea into a profitable reality. The power of market research. In this comprehensive guide, we'll be covering everything you need to know about market research and how to leverage it to transform your idea into a successful business. So buckle up, grab a notepad and pen, and let's get started. Introduction. The importance of market research. Before we dive into the nitty gritty of market research, let's talk about why it's so important. You see, many entrepreneurs and innovators have amazing ideas, but not all of them know how to turn those ideas into successful businesses. This is where market research comes in. It helps you understand the potential of your idea, the target audience, the competition, and so much more. By conducting thorough market research, you can identify if there's a demand for your product or service, determine the right target audience, understand your competition and how to differentiate yourself, define the right pricing strategy, and ultimately increase your chances of success. So now that you know why market research is crucial, let's dive into the process and learn how to do it effectively. Identifying your target market. The first step in market research is identifying your target market. This is the group of people or businesses that are most likely to buy your product or service. To do this, you can follow these steps. A. Define your ideal customer. Start by creating a detailed profile of your ideal customer. Consider demographics, psychographics, geographics, geographic location, and any other relevant factors. B. Identify your niche. Your niche is the specific segment of the market where your product or service fits best. By focusing on a niche, you can cater to the unique needs and preferences of your target customers, making your offering more appealing to them. C. Market size and potential. Estimate the size of your target market and its potential for growth. This will help you determine if there's enough demand for your product or service and if the market is worth pursuing. Conducting competitive analysis. Understanding your competition is a vital part of market research. It helps you uncover gaps in the market, identify potential threats, and find ways to differentiate your product or service. To conduct a competitive analysis, follow these steps. A. Identify your competitors. Make a list of your direct and indirect competitors. Direct competitors offer similar products or services, while indirect competitors fulfill the same customer needs through different means. B. Analyze their offerings. Examine the features, benefits, and pricing of your competitors' products or services. Determine their strengths and weaknesses and identify any opportunities for your business to stand out. C. Assess their market positioning. Understand how your competitors position themselves in the market, including their target audience, unique selling propositions, and marketing strategies. D. Learn from their successes and mistakes. Look for patterns in your competitors' successes and failures. This can give you valuable insights into what works and what doesn't in your industry, helping you avoid costly mistakes and capitalize on proven strategies. Analyzing market trends and opportunities. Keeping up with market trends and emerging opportunities is crucial for staying ahead of the game and ensuring your product or service stays relevant. Here's how you can analyze market trends and opportunities. A. Monitor industry news and publications. Stay updated on the latest news, trends, and developments in your industry. Subscribe to relevant newsletters, blogs, and magazines, and follow industry influencers on social media. B. Attend industry events and conferences. Industry events and conferences are excellent opportunities to learn about emerging trends, technologies, and innovations. They also provide networking opportunities with like-minded individuals and potential partners or customers. C. Use market research tools and data sources. Leverage market research tools and data sources such as Google Trends, Statista, and market research reports to gather information on market trends, consumer behavior, and industry growth rates. D. Identify emerging opportunities. Look for potential opportunities by analyzing changes in consumer preferences, technological advancements, and regulatory changes. These factors can create new market demands or open up new market segments that your business can capitalize on. 
conducting primary and secondary research. To gather all the necessary data for your market research, you'll need to conduct both primary and secondary research. Primary research involves collecting new data directly from your target audience, while secondary research involves analyzing existing data and information. A. Primary research methods, surveys and questionnaires. Create online or paper surveys to gather feedback and opinions from your target audience. You can use platforms like SurveyMonkey or Google Forms to create and distribute your survey. Interviews. Conduct 111 interviews with potential customers or industry experts to gather in depth insights and opinions. Focus groups. Organize focus group discussions with a small group of your target audience to explore their thoughts, feelings, and preferences regarding your product or service. Observations and field studies. Observe customer behavior and interactions with your product or service in real life settings to gather first hand data. B. Secondary research sources. Market research reports. Purchase or access market research reports from reputable sources like Ibisworld, Gartner, or Forrester to gather data on your industry, market trends, and consumer behavior. Government and trade association publications. Use data from government and trade association publications to understand industry regulations, standards, and statistics. Academic and industry journals. Review academic and industry journals to gather insights into new research, trends, and innovations in your field. Competitor websites and marketing materials. Analyze your competitors' websites, marketing materials, and customer reviews to gain insights into their strategies, offerings, and customer feedback. Analyzing and applying your research findings. After gathering all the necessary data, it's time to analyze your findings and use them to make informed decisions about your business. Here are some steps to help you do that. A. Identify key insights. Look for patterns, trends, and correlations in your data that can provide valuable insights into your target market, competition, and industry. B. Develop strategies based on your findings. Use your research findings to develop effective strategies for product development, pricing, positioning, marketing, and sales. C. Test and validate your assumptions. Before fully committing to your strategies, test your assumptions through experiments, pilots, or minimum viable products to validate their effectiveness and gather real, world feedback. D. Continuously monitor and update your research. Market research is an ongoing process. Continuously monitor changes in your industry, market, and competition and update your research and strategies accordingly. And that's a wrap. By following these steps and leveraging the power of market research, you can turn your idea into a profitable reality. Remember, market research is the foundation upon which you build your business. It provides you with the insights, knowledge, and strategies needed to create a successful, sustainable, and competitive product or service. So, get out there and start researching as you gain a better understanding of your target market, competition, and industry trends, you'll be better equipped to make informed decisions that will propel your business to success. If you found this guide helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your fellow entrepreneurs, and subscribe to our channel for more valuable content on entrepreneurship and business strategies. And as always, if you have any questions or need additional guidance, feel free to leave a comment below and we'll do our best to help you out. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video, where we'll dive even deeper into the world of entrepreneurship and business success. Until then, happy researching and best of luck turning your idea into a profitable reality.